So this is one thing that's big for me and I'm very passionate about is you are what you think. The mind is where the battles are lost and won. If the devil can get your mind, then you lost. It, but if you fortify your mind and keep it as strong as possible, and how you do that, renewing it every day, transforming your mind, be transformed by the renewing of your mind through the word, through reading, through getting in your purpose, getting in presence with your creator getting that relationship with him reading the bible praying constantly renewing your mind that gives you that will transform your life i, pro- I promise you transform your mentality you transform your life and you have to constantly do that though you have to constantly do it you can't carry the same mindset of what you did last year maybe definitely not five years ago ten years ago you can't take your previous mindset into the next level because you aren't that same person anymore and what your path is in front of you what you're about to embark on is going to take a whole new level of thinking your mind has to be so much stronger so fortifying your mind by renewing it and transforming it with prayer and reading and solitude another way that your mind can be your enemy or your best friend is you have what you say and you have not just you have what you say but you you have what you think it the words that come out of your mouth start with a thought and the thought turns into words and words turn into real things that man a man has what he speaks a man has what he is a man is what he thinks and i think you can't even let a negative thought come into your mind everything that comes into your mind needs to be positive some people call it the law of attraction law of attraction is whatever it is you think and speak that's what you attract to you so if you think negative thoughts then that's what's gonna come your way you wonder why all these bad things keep happening to you because you're thinking it and you're saying it well i don't know why this keeps happening I, oh i'm when you, when you get sick you've probably been talking about it now people get get sick it happens like it's it's, it's part of life but i'm talking about people that are speaking things over their lives be careful with what you think because if you think it you'll say it if you say it you'll be it so watch your thoughts guard your thoughts because i promise you it will get deep down inside of you and whatever you keep thinking it'll be a cycle start with even if you don't believe it maybe start writing it out or read something inspirational read read, if you don't want to read the bible Read something inspirational. Like, there's so much negative stuff out there. I got plenty of inspirational stuff on my... Like, I don't do negativity. So, something inspirational, if you read it, it'll get in your spirit. If it gets in your spirit, in your mind, and you start speaking it, it's a cycle. Nothing but good is going to come your way. Like, the bad stuff will come out against you, but your mind will be so strong and so fortified that it's not going to matter none of that stuff is going to matter it's going to bounce off you like water on the dust bag just roll off it's going to be nothing now it gets hard it does and that constant renewal is every day it's not just you know okay well I turn 30 so I'm going to turn into a new person and then when you turn 31 you stay the same person or if you turn 40 You wait till you turn 40 to turn into a new person. It doesn't work like that. Like, my goal is to be better than my previous self, which means yesterday, the day before, last year, like, times before that. Whatever your previous self that you're competing against, that should be your only competition. Better than your previous self. 
be better than your previous self by renewing your mind, strengthening your mind, and don't let negative thoughts take root. Because if they do, they'll come out and they'll be your surroundings. It will turn, your environment will turn into, will be your thoughts. Your thoughts will turn into your environment. Does that make sense? Doesn't matter. I'll say it again some other time. But think about it. Your mind.